scientists and eh. um, welcome again to Ice Dynamo. Uh, today I'd like to show you how to use an analytical balance to weigh out your reagents precisely. And I wanted to preface by saying that I am not trying to insult your intelligence. This probably seems pretty obvious, but it's been so long ago since I've learned some of these techniques. It, it seems obvious to me now because I've done it a million times. and. It certainly wasn't obvious, at least some of them weren't obvious when I started, so I didn't want to gloss over anything. Okay, without further ado, let me show you how this is done. This is our analytical balance. You can see this little one has, um, uh, the most you can weigh out is 100 grams, and it's got a precision of a hundredth of a gram. So the first thing you want to do is make sure it's clean, and then turn on. This one you got to give it a little English. Okay, so it should start out at zero grams, and you can certainly weigh out stuff directly on here, um, although a lot of the stuff you'll be weighing out is in powder form, and you can imagine it's really hard to like scrape the powder off once you've weighed it and get that precise amount into your um, vessel of whatever sort. So what, what we often do is we either put down like a piece of wax paper or even like a little plastic dish. Um, now you'll see that the plastic dish weighs more than nothing, right? And, and if, say you're weighing out 20 grams of potatoes, you don't want to weigh out 20 grams of potatoes plus the dish, so what we do is we tear. So that'll be, um, you know, it, it'll sort of subtract the weight of the dish from the weight of your, from the overall weight of the dish and your reagents, so that when you them in there, you can precisely weigh out what you'd like. That's it. Now if you're weighing out more than one thing, you may want to have multiple pieces of wax paper. It just makes life easier. Um, the other thing I wanted to point out to you was that um, in between weighings, you might get a little something on your balance, um, which it may recognize. So 